家千祈唔好以為有一個錯覺，唔係話全部成個警答出嚟嘅。Ken Ki Chen, spokesman for the Federation of Hong Kong Filmmakers, expressed doubts on turning the film set of the recently released Twilight of the Warriors World In into public exhibits. The Hong Kong movie, which received a standing ovation at this year's Cannes Film Festival, completed shooting two years ago and centers around the Kowloon Ward city during the 1980s. His remarks came after the government expressed interest in turning the movie set into a tourist attraction. 拍戏始终会系一种诶就方便同埋就镜头感嘅。参观同又系另外一件事嚟噶嘛。参观嘅我哋要考虑安全啊。There are various concerns in shooting a movie on set and setting up an exhibit for the public, he said. A movie set focuses on creative aspects and convenience for crew members, but a public exhibition of the same set should be refined and, most of all, designed to be safe. Will not have lost that excitement? Tin also raised concerns on whether the film would have lost its popularity when the exhibition is ready for the public. The location where the exhibit can be placed is another factor Tin highlighted. Site of the original Kowloon Ward city was turned into a park 29 years ago, he said. West Kowloon Cultural District was an option, but exposure to the elements would be a hindrance, Tin said. On the other hand, Li Chiu Yu, district councillor from Kowloon City South, expressed support and says keeping the set near the original location of the Kowloon Ward city would give visitors a more surreal experience. Nearby areas such as Kai Tak should also be considered, as the Walled City Park is undergoing redevelopment. Can you think of any space where you can put the movie scenes and the scenes? Authorities may consider freeing up a spot at the site for the exhibits, he said. The government could also take the opportunity to promote local culture, such as offering fishbowl making workshops on the site to further recreate the essence of the film. Providing a more nostalgic experience of the Kowloon Ward City. Genesis U, Cable News.